a Friday. If you're looking for fun and a girls' night out, search no further. How about a gallery stroll coming up this weekend? Pam from Every Blooming Thing and her friend Stephanie is here to tell us about this event. It happens every Friday? No, no, no. The How third, often? The third Friday okay. of every month. And there are numbers of galleries that participate. And up in our area, gallery on 15th and 15th, a gallery across the street, and we participate in that but we have a special night tonight because we're featuring all of our lady artists and they're going to be there for you to meet so before we jump into Stephanie uh, we want to talk to you and your creations why did you get involved I know that you're amazing at flowers tell us your connection to art Pam um, that's the pond I grew up in I was swimming in the art pond my father is a sculptor of note uh, my mother was an interior designer loved fabric and colors and Art has always been a part of my life, and so when Every Blooming Thing was opened in 1977, art was part of that. And there's art inside Every oh, Blooming Thing. absolutely. What do you love? What, what do you have an eye for? Oh my gosh. All of these artists are fabulous, but Stephanie and I have known each other for 30 years. Yes. And Stephanie, tell us about you and your creations. Well, I began this mixed media technique. It's a painted and layered technique on wood. Mm -hmm. uh, the same with the jewelry. And I began in 1983 doing jewelry for Saks Fifth Avenue. And it expanded into large paintings. And now I show with Pam and uh, do a few festivals around the country and just uh, have continued doing this full time. Where do you get your inspiration? Well, much as, like Pam, I have a deep love of nature. I feature a lot of trees and flowers, um, animals in my work. And really, inspiration is the fun part. So that's that's pretty easy. I, I love what I do. How long would it take you to put something like these pieces together? Well, I work on several at one time. The small ones might take a couple of weeks, and the larger pieces may take about a month. What's the sheen on that? That is a clear resin finish. That's what's on the, yes. on the top of it? And it's her own invention. <laughs> I mean, it's specifically Stephanie's deal. Can you describe it to the viewers while we look at your art? Like, what are we seeing? What goes into well, that? Well, this begins on a wood panel, there, okay. and there is no glass involved. I begin with acrylic paints, and in the tree portion, I use a lot of silver leaf. Silver leaf and gold leaf. I love to use that. And then sometimes a little glitter, because glitter is good for the soul, I believe. I love it. And then many uh, clear finishes of resin that bring out the color. Not only that, can we take a, a picture of you and your awesome necklace that you oh. also made? That dragonfly. <laughs> Oh, the jewelry. The jewelry. <laughs> to wear mm -hmm. a piece of original art mm -hmm. is really fun. Not just hang it in your home, but put it around, around your, your neck. neck and have it with you. So it's this is fun. the third Friday of every single month. So tonight it's happening. Yes. Okay, where should, and, we, where should we meet, Pam? Uh, 21, well, 1433 South, 2100 East, 6 to 9. And we should mention some of our other artists we have. Yes. That we have here. Um, let's see, who have I got? I've got Sandy Olson, mm -hmm. I've got Joan Zone, just, we probably have 15 ladies represented, uh, and, mo and a lot of them will be there tonight, it's like Stephanie mm -hmm. has a following. And oh, so, I'm sure. And I'm so sure, whenever Stephanie. Stephanie is part of things, we see a group of people that just love her work. Mm -hmm. Likewise, our other female Ladies, artists. let's go support other women doing amazing things. Yes. And have fun on a Friday night. It. Go to our website for all the information, abc4.com slash gtu, the gallery stroll. All of that will be right there. And don't forget to walk around every blooming thing. Can I brag about you for just a second? Please. Not only is she, <laughs> please do. Not only is she sweet, but look what she did for me last night. Alta High School Dance Company needed flowers for the girls to sell for their dance company, which my daughter's on. Look what every blooming thing did. The highlight of the night is walking by those flowers for all those girls. So thank you so much. Oh, well, Pam and we Robert, love you, Nisha. So and how nice to meet you. Thank been. you very Stephanie. much. Up next, everybody, Shepherd's Pie in the Kitchen, right? And coming up, see what it means to have a sinner.